Oh ho man, what's up everybody? It's early in the morning, just got here. And uh, this is the best time for me to make videos because no one's really around so I can kind of yell at you guys and have fun. And uh, it's kind of weird with people around talking to myself. Got to get used to that I guess. Uh, so here's the deal. I got some very interesting stuff that I want you guys to look at. I need your opinion on. I want you to get involved with this one and see where it takes us. Uh, I currently am going to be doing or maybe doing some experience with uh, LENR uh, which if you guys don't know it's uh, low energy nuclear reactions most of you should know that um, if you follow my work you've probably seen the cold fusion experiments that's what this is now there's a gentleman by the name of Tony Smith uh, and he calls this particular experiment he wants the jitterbug uh, structure okay so I'm for all intensive purposes I'm going to call this the jitterbug jitterbug experiment, okay? Now, here's the deal. Um, I want you guys to look over this paper that Tony's presented and I'll link it in the description and I want you guys to give me feedback on it and just throw the information back at me and give me your your opinions. I'm going to post a link over at the forums or to the forums where I'm going to be posting this information. And I want you to go there and respond if you can, because it's easier to track information over there if you send me an email uh, or leave it in the YouTube comments. Sometimes it'll get lost, especially in YouTube comments for sure. I, uh, I usually don't lose my emails, but sometimes I uh, get too many to go through and um, get distracted on where's what and whatever. So anyway, email's fine, but please go over the forums if you're going to do feedback. Now here's the deal. Uh, the reason that we're even doing this experiment is because it has to do with um, the theory that we're working on here at quantumgravityresearch.org. So um, it's interesting because it's a prediction of the cold fusion um, and Tony's theory. So if it works, great. If it doesn't, um, I don't know what to tell you. But I don't know if I have the correct uh, stuff here to do this experiment properly to get the accurate data that I need. So I want your opinion on that. I want, you, I want your opinion on what kind of things that I would actually need to get this experiment accomplished. Um, I don't have anything to do uh, cold fusion with. I don't have any uh, testing equipment that I think I need. You know, a lot of the different... Uh, basically, I need a, a higher scientific uh, data recording type of situation going on to really get everything in this experiment done on a level that's going to be um, credible. Okay. Now, if the experiment works at all on the in the garage lab, okay, then we can send this experiment to a higher lab, uh, somebody that's been doing cold fusion for a long time. They can set up the experiment and validate it with their equipment. Now, the question is, is do we want to do that right away, since they already have everything set up, or do I want to try it uh, along with your collaboration and see if what we can come up with? So again. The, the, the important part here is we want to do this experiment following the ideas and principles based on Tony Smith's idea because it, it directly relates to the theories that they're working on here. Okay, So that's the important part to remember. Don't get off tangent on something that's like not related because cold fusion is a huge field and there's a bunch of different options, but this is the experiment we want to do. So the paper that I have is, uh, I have it pulled up here on my computer. But uh, what I'm going to do is just, uh, I'm going to post a link to it and let you guys read it. So everything will be in the description. So give me your feedback, give me your thoughts. A lot of you uh, are very interested in this. You know way more than I do about this stuff. Um, it'll be a steep learning curve if I do the ex experiment on my own. Um, but it, nothing we can't handle. And I just want your guys' opinion. So, all right, go. Go now. Russ with rwgresearch.com. Uh, I'll speak at you again later. Um, that's it. I'll leave all my other projects to another video. Peace.